Now, it was a bunch of black hoes and sissy thugs out here fighting. You got boats and on a beach. And guess what Negroes want to do? Beat each other's heads. And I tell you, boy, ain't no help for the black community. It's done. It's a wrap. Let's get into the show. What's going on? It's your boy Zillionaire. Welcome to the mother freaking show. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and all of that good stuff. You know, the truth speaker, the guy that makes everybody mad. Nobody wants to hear the truth. Now, they down there on the beach, a bunch of black folk. You know, if it's a bunch of black folk all together, you know something going to pop off. <laughs> can't go nowhere where it's full of black folk. You just can't. Either they're going to start shooting fighting it's gonna get crazy it's like you just go you just wait and you see when the train wreck is about to hit they down there on the beach got nice boats and everything now beautiful in florida and uh this is what's going on this is what they're saying happened on social media you know every time i watch a video i go on social media to see what they're talking about now it, it, this this is what allegedly is supposed to have happened two women Got to an argument because you know black women love to argue they love drama they love to fight they can start arguing and one of the guys stepped in the argument one of the guys uh one of the one of the girl's boyfriend stepped in then the other girl's boyfriend stepped in then the girl started swinging the next you know or the guy started fighting and all hell broke loose i tell you boy it's no help for the black community it's a rap it's over <laughs> it's done it's a rap it's a rap there is absolutely no help for the black community. Black folk don't want to learn nothing. They don't want to better themselves. They don't want to get wisdom. They don't want to get knowledge. They want to pass down generational curses. They don't want to hear the truth. Um, it's just sad. Can't go nowhere with a bunch of black folk. They will destroy everything and everywhere they go. A community full of masculine women and sissy thugs. And you should have seen how these sissies was fighting. <laughs> they were swinging like sissies. I like, look at these sissy swing. <laughs> One dude was like, come on, come on. Dude swung like a sissy, I tell you, boy. <laughs> oh, man, it's no help for the black community. It's no help. It is no help. Can't help them. It's just sad. <laughs> it's sad. Can't help them. So I just, I, I'm just going to laugh and watch the train wreck. People don't want help. A lot of people get mad at me because the truth. There is no help for the black community. You cannot help people that don't want help. You just can't. They don't, they don't want to learn. Nothing. That's why, if you notice, the most ignorant, violent videos get, get the most views. Why is that? Why do the most ignorant, violent uh, videos get the most views? Because that's what black folk like to see. That's what people love to watch. They love this stuff. Y'all can't even go down on a beach and enjoy each other and, enjoy, and have fun. You can't even go down on the beach and relax and chill without worrying about somebody trying to take your life or somebody fighting or somebody getting injured or somebody getting hurt. You can't even chill and relax around supposedly your own people. It's sad. Black folk do the most damage, most harm to each other. And you want to talk about oppression and racism. I mean, come on. We, we already know that's there. We get that. But look at the stuff y'all do to each other every day. Huh? There's no unity in, among our community. There's no unity. There's no, there's none of that. It's just none. You, and, and where there's no unity, what it say? A house divided against itself cannot stand. It's divided in the black community. Just can't help Negroes. Just can't. Um, like I said, it's only going to be a handful of Negroes that's going to get be saved or be delivered or, you know, or get out of that, that dark lifestyle or, you know, not destroy themselves and destroy their family and destroy their legacy. It's only going to be a few. Only going to be a few. And uh, there you have it. It's sad. That's why when I go on vacation, if I see more than one, <laughs> you know they got a gun. <laughs> if it's two or more than three, you better flee. I tell you, boy. <laughs> man. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. 
I come and I'm like, this is the one of the most embarrassing vacation. They supposed to be on vacation enjoying themselves, man. You can't do it. That's why I like going to multicultural places. I like going where there's many different cultures. If I go to a sports bar anywhere, I'm not going nowhere where there's a bunch of Negroes. Only where I go where it's, where, where it's a bunch of people, it has to be black excellence. It has to be black folk on another level. You know, like here out here in Georgia, Buckhead, Georgia, Buckhead, um, you know, out here in Brookhaven, Buckhead, that's where the uppity black folk are at. And if I go anywhere, I, I'm chilling in Buckhead. I'm going to be out in Buckhead if I'm going to be around anybody, anybody. It's going to be uh, people, uh, black folk of a higher standard. Or if I'm working in the industry, it's, it's black folk of a higher standard. I'm not going to be going nowhere where it's just low-level Negroes. <laughs> I ain't doing it. I'm your boy, Zero Zillion. Eh? You can't help them. It's a rat. It's a rat. And y'all know it's the truth. You can't help the black community. Sad. That's just, It's just sad. It's, you know, it's just a hurtful truth. The truth don't feel good, do it? Man. You can't even enjoy the vacation, man. Man. Now, somebody's going to hop on this post and justify this behavior like y'all always do. And, you know, when y'all hop on my post and justify the behavior, do you do you realize you're proving my point? <laughs> when you try to justify it, you're just proving everything I'm saying. I'm out of here.